Good morning, guys. Let's write together. So we are writing about what we want to be when we grow up. And since I'm grown up, I'm going to write about being a teacher to you guys. So got my paper. What is the very first thing that I need to write? The most important word that you need to know. Your name, right? So I'm going to write in my name. A A T I E. Now I'm going to draw a picture of what it's like to be a teacher. So I'm going to draw a board. And I'm going to draw me. And I'm going to draw no, and some hair. And then I'm going to draw little heads for you guys. And then I'm going to label, right? So I'm going to say this is me, me, and this is the b, b board. B board, and these are the students, students. So that's where I'm going to start, and then I'm going to have um, a pre-written part that says, I want to be a, so your grown up can write that part. I want to be a, and then you think of your word. I want to be a teacher. T -t 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 Timothy Tiger says, t -t -t -e -ch -ch -ch. Oopsies, that E didn't work out so well. That's a blend that we haven't learned yet, but that's a C and an H together. Ch -ch. Er, Robbie Rabbit says, er, er. I want to be a teacher. And then if I have time, I'm gonna go back and I'm gonna add detail. Do you remember what detail is? It is what makes the picture look more real so that you can really tell what that picture is. So if all you do is this first part, that's fine. If you wanna do that next part, that's fine too. And if you wanna add detail, that's fantastic. But you do whatever you've got time for. So the first part is to draw your picture and label it. If that's all you get done today, you did a fantastic job. Just make sure your grown up writes what you said so that you can remember. And then if you have time and you're feeling motivated, you have your grown up right, I want to be a, and they can help you sound out that last word, t -t teacher or doctor or whatever you wanna be. And then if you're feeling really motivated, you can go back and add detail. So I'm gonna add some detail. Usually on our board, we have letters and numbers, right? So I'm gonna put some letters. I'm gonna put an A, a B, a C and a D. And I'm gonna put some numbers. I'm gonna put a one, a two, a three, and a four. And I'm gonna draw a student at the board because you guys are very often at the board. So I'm gonna draw somebody up at the board with a marker in their hand. And this is the back of their head, so we can't see them, but I'll draw a little hair. I'm gonna go back to me. I'm missing some stuff. I'm missing glasses, so I'm going to draw my glasses on there. I'm going to give my hair a little better. It's not like I'm having a good hair day. Yeah, I'm going to give myself some clothes. A skirt. And a shirt. And then I'm going to draw Miss Marissa. Draw Miss Marissa. Get a big smile on Miss Marissa because she always has a big smile. So you can draw some details, right? I could also draw some details on you guys. 
I can pretend like you're facing forward and give you all smiley faces. I could draw a rug. You're all sitting on the different colored squares. I could draw a poster on the wall over here with all your pictures. So you can do whatever you want to do on here. Just remember there's three steps to writing. So you just get through whatever step that you get through and make that step the best one that you can make it. And then if you get to the next one, make that one the best one you can do. And if you get to the next one, make that the best you can do. All I want you to do is your best. You got to practice writing every day because practice makes us what? Better. Practice makes us better. So even though we aren't together, that's why I still want you to be reading and writing and doing math so that you can keep practicing and keep getting better. So show me your pictures. I can't wait to see what you want to be when you grow up. I love you guys. Have a great day.